Hi everybody, hope you're well. So I'm going to talk about reserved DC boxes. The reason I want to talk about this is because perhaps in the past you only let your certain friends use your EC, maybe you just want to use your EC and somebody has got a horse into your EC that you didn't want them in because you either need the box or whatever. So I'm going to talk about ways to help prevent that. Now it is sometimes it's very easy to forget, I've done it myself. But obviously the quality. So if, for example, now, if you are buying boxes, there's a certain VIP perk which you ha you can get, which allows you to reserve a box as soon as you buy it. Now, if you don't have that VIP perk, when you buy that box, the box is open to the public. That's where the problem comes in, because maybe you want to use this box, and you're buying this box, you really need this box, right? And you don't have the ability to reserve it with the VIP park. And I'm just going to quickly show you the VIP park if I can remember where it is. Oh, wait a minute. So Longma can reserve boxes right after their purchase. So if you have the Longma Divine, I won one in a past lottery. Um, that basically gives you that ability to do that. But if you don't have it, the only way really that you can sort of work around that is to go into your boarding and to put up the quality of the borders. So you can put it up something really, really high that hardly anybody's going to be able to enter a horse or maybe so high that nobody can put in a horse. And whether that's 3,000 skills or 4,000 skills, depending on what server you're on, um, it'll be lower for others. So you can do that. And that'll maybe help to prevent that. Well, it gives you a couple of seconds to go in to that box that you have you know if I just quickly go in so let's say we had a box here that wasn't reserved we could we'll just unreserve it actually no actually we don't want to do that so you would go in there and you click to reserve this box and then you would type in the name of the person click change to reservation and then once that was there then you'd be like well it's fine now you've got the box now the other thing to keep in mind because I've been told this by a couple of people if you have stuff in the workshop it's like I've got two boxes in here Basically, whenever a box is complete in the workshop, I have been told this, I haven't, I'm not 100% sure on this, but basically it's not automatically reserved. So as soon as your box is ready and you click retrieve it, the box is open to the public. So what you might want to do first is, as I said, go into office, boarding, and put up the quality of the horses that have to go into your, well, that would be required in your seat, and then go and reserve your box for yourself. So that's a couple of ways just to make sure you keep your boxes where you want to keep them you know we all forget I've had times where I've completely forgotten that I've got like 10 horses from the whole weekend and I'm like I needed those boxes but it happens anyway guys I hope you love your day bye bye